Our team coverage now moves to CBS 4's Maribel Rodriguez. She's live at Miami International Airport with more on how the winter storm is impacting travel. Maribel, good morning. Good morning. I do not want to be there at all. And if you're going to get stranded, hey, Miami is definitely the place to be. Those heading to the Northeast or flying out of the Northeast are not going anywhere as of this morning. Here at MIA, we checked this morning. Departing flights, close to 32 cancellations. Arrivals, close to 36 have been canceled. As you saw, the Northeast getting slammed by snow. I want to go to show you the board here of departures. As you can see, all the flights um, departing New York as of, there you have it, as of 6 o'clock this morning canceled all the way through 10 o'clock this morning and I'm sure those numbers are going to continue to rise there you have also Newark canceled you have DC Boston Philadelphia also canceled no one is getting in or out um, of the Northeast or um, you know stranded here at MIA we did speak with uh, several passengers who are stranded here this is what they had to say I'm waiting to get into Philadelphia and they're waiting to get into New York City, and we can't get anywhere because they've shut down the East Coast. So again, we did check this morning here out of MIA. Uh, departing flights close to 32 cancellations. Those are all to the Northeast in and out. Arrivals close to 36. And same goes for Fort Lauderdale. No one getting aired out of the Northeast from Fort Lauderdale or to Miami. So if you are heading out, if you do have a flight early this morning and even this afternoon, you may call your airline ahead of time. And if you are here in Miami, you may just want to wait it out. We're live at MIA. Maribel Rodriguez, CBS 4 this morning.